Hi everyone, today I'll do a quick tour on how to create a multi-column layout in Notion. This can help you create a more organized and dynamic dashboard to easily see what you need quickly, especially on larger screens such as your laptops or monitors. So let's get started. To create a multi-column view, click and drag using the six dots on the left side of any Notion block to the left or right side of any block. You will then see a vertical blue line indicating that a new column will be created once you drop the block. You can create three or four as many columns as you need by repeating the process. And if you want to resize the column, Away between the two blocks and you should see a vertical grey line which you can drag left or right to resize the respective column. This works for almost every other Notion blocks like callouts, pages and images, but except databases. When you try to drag your database view left or right of any block, there won't be a vertical blue line that appears. So how do you create a multi-column layout for database? If you want to have two database views side by side or a database view beside another Notion block, you must first create a multi-column view using other Notion blocks. So in this case, we first create a column view using the heading blocks, and then we drag the database under the respective column. Some of you might also want to create column view inside a toggle view or inside a call-out block. You first create a page and create a multi-column layout inside the page. Once done, you can then drag this page under the toggle view you want to create a multi-column view. And the last step will just be to turn this page into a text block, and you will have a multi-column layout inside a toggle view. That's it on creating multi-column layout in Notion. I do hope you found this helpful and if there's anything you want to see in my next video, share your suggestions below.